Fake Faded in Central Iceland on Suffolk Avenue. And you know what it is, it's time for another instant pop-up trivia game. You wanna see who's gonna win? All right, let's go on in. And we're back here at Stay Faded on Suffolk Avenue in Central Iceland for another round of our instant trivia pop-up game. We're playing Family Feud. We've got player one and we've got player two. Are y'all ready? All right. Name a place where you fall asleep when you shouldn't. Network. Correct, and that's the top answer. <laughs> Next question. Name a place you never want to find your partner. Good love. Correct, and that's the top answer. Name something you wish you would never stop growing. My hair off. Correct, and that's the top answer. Name something you never want to see on your old aunt. I ass. <laughs> that is not and <laughs> that is not the top answer though. That's the second top like, answer. Still, you got a chance to steal. Name something you never want to see on your old aunt. Naked. And you got that. I get it. You got that. No bro. Stop walking back. And we're back here at Stay Faded on Suffolk Avenue in Central Iceland for another round of our instant trivia pop-up game brought to you by Knockwell Games. We've got player one and player two. Our category today is sports, and they're playing for a free Firestone oil change. Are you ready, gentlemen? Yep. Yeah. All right, here is your first question. Hands on your buzzers, please. Tell me, what team won the very first NBA game? Was it A, Chicago Stags, B, Philadelphia Warriors, C, Toronto Huskies, or D, the New York Knicks? Philadelphia Warriors. And incorrect. Chance to steal. Uh, uh, what, say it again real quick. Chicago Stags, Philadelphia Warriors, yeah. Toronto Huskies, and the New York Knicks. I say number one. What was number one? Chicago. Chicago. And incorrect, the New York Knicks Nick. defeated. I was gonna say Knicks, Knicks but the Knicks, Knicks are so trash. They're so trash. Back in the day, I should have said that. Yeah. All right, hands on your buttons, ready for the next one. What NBA player scored 100 points on March 2nd in 1962? What kind of Frazier? And. 100 points? And when? Yes. And when, you said? In 1962. Was it. Was it Bill Ross? Yeah, yeah, I was Where back. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. He got I'm some back. help from the crowd. Get out of here, funny head. You <laughs> look like a lollipop. All right, gentlemen, next one. Hands on your buzzers, please. Who was the first player in NBA history to be elected league MVP by a unanimous vote? Was it A, Magic Johnson, B, Michael Jordan, C, LeBron James, or D, Stephen Curry? Steph Curry. Correct. 2016, after a record breaking season, the Warriors. You say put his head down. The NBA's first unanimous, most valuable player. Two more to go. Question number four. Hands on your buzzers, please. What new kind of shot did Joe Folks score a record 63 points with in one game in 1949? A hook shot. It was a jump shot. Jump shot, jump shot. Jump shot. Same yeah. shit. You gotta jump when you shoot a hook. <laughs> Damn, well, you good over there? All right, yeah. gentlemen. Last question. Number five here. Who scored the first three point basket in NBA history? A. Wes Unsell. B. Gene Stump. C. Chris Ford. Or D. Larry Bird. Larry Bird. And. Kansas hey, wow, he white. B. B. Gene Stump is incorrect. The right answer oh, is Chris we got, Ford. We got to do another one. <laughs> we tied. We got to do the tiebreaker. Mm -hmm. All right. Last question to break the tie. Who was the youngest player to score 10,000 points in the NBA? A. Michael Jordan. B. Kobe Bryant. C. Will Chamberlain. Or D. LeBron James. Kobe Bryant. Kobe Bryant. What do you say? Will Chamberlain. 
both of those are incorrect. LeBron. No. LeBron. The king is oh, winner. Now we got the tiebreaker. We do have to do a tiebreaker, yeah, and it's gonna be real cool. simple. Here we go. Hands on your buzzers, please. What team owns the longest winning streak in NBA history? Is it A, the Miami Heat? Is it B, the Los Angeles Lakers? C, Chicago Bulls? Or D, the Golden State Warriors? Golden State Warriors. Eh, that is I say correct. the Lakers. Correct, it's the Los uh, Angeles oh, Lakers. And there you have it, we've got right. a winner. I was gonna give it to the Nigga, I need the oil change. I need the oil change. I was giving it to him anyway. He was gonna call. I need the oil change. I was giving it to him anyway. He was gonna look out for me anyway. Make sure you stop by right here at State Faded in Suffolk, Central Islip, the place to be. That was choice. You got the good game. You ready? How long did you date before introducing your partner to your family? A year. And six months. Six months is correct. My man. You know what I'm saying? Well done. Nice and done. I got my most beautiful day. That's it? We done? Yeah, that's it. I got my most beautiful day. I got my most beautiful day. Oh, no. Because I don't have to go to my family. That takes nothing. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's it. Winner of our game is Boya One. Congratulations. She's the winner of our Little Caesars Prize. 68 East Suffolk State Fairy Barbershop. Come on, Dad. Come on, Dad. We wide open. Take two. It's funny, I did fine outside. 